G'day fellas, and welcome to another Beyond All Reason game. Today, I'm going to be trying a new strategy, something that I've actually had done against me. It was pretty damn strong when I played against it, so I'm looking to try and emulate that same success. The only difference is I'm going to be doing it from the Geospot. Now, what was that strategy? The strategy is that I'm going to be attempting a comm drop. I'm going to be attempting to drop my comm over on the Geo player uh, and on their base. So I'm going to come in from this angle here, bring it down, and look to push in towards their position, look to degun the Geo, look to degun the T2 lab if I possibly can, uh, and hopefully build myself a nice little lead from this Geo spot. I'm also going to be linking up with my air player at the same time and making sure that they are going to be bringing some pain as well, because that's really important that we, uh, we communicate and make sure that everybody's on the same page. So he's going to be preparing for an attack. So we're going to be aiming for around the six minute mark. So I'm not going to be going for T2. I'm just going to be going for T1, going to air, and then after that, then we'll mix in some T2 a little bit later. So we'll see how we go. Our standard opening is going to be happening though. Let's make sure that we leave a space here just for our nano. And it looks like our wind has stalled out completely. So I think I'm going to have to throw down a, stop, a solar here. You never want to have to do this, but it looks like it is starting to pick back up though. But I think it's still worth throwing down the solar even at this point. I don't think we're going to get through all of our metal. Actually, we might, so I might have to reclaim this. But once this Laz comes out, we should be fine. All right, so wind has started to pick up as well. So we're up to 16 wind, and yeah, you can see all of a sudden we are absolutely fine. So I think we're probably about 10, 15 seconds behind now because of that, but it's not a huge deal. Not a huge deal. Everyone's behind because of it. Because remember, everybody plays wind on a map like this. All right, so we're going to look to place our nano down, so it's going to cover all three of our mexes. And our commander is going to help out with it. And we're going to place down a second nano, making sure that they link up as well and that it covers all of our, our main goals here. So we can now move on. And then we'll look to put the Geo down as far away as we can. All right, let's, let's go and let's take these rocks because it looks like someone else is going to be taking them very, very soon. So we'll just get in as much as we can. And... Let's get our next Lazarus out over here. Looks like there's already some leakings coming through, but they are going to get picked up. Well done by Military Grade Cat. A lovely name, by the way. All right, so it looks like that one's finished, so can help out here. And there we go. Looks like the leaks are coming through, but the commander should cover for us. Aircraft spotted. All right, so we did indeed run out of... Let's just get that. Actually, we can run you down here. Let's let's get you down instead. One, two, three. And I'm going to go into some energy converters now. So actually, we don't want to put them down there. We want we want to move them up because that's where we want to expand. So we'll go for that. That should be good. <coughs> Uh, and so we're also going to be looking to build our aircraft plant soon. Let's just make sure that these guys have all got rally points because we don't want them to go idle. So you can see already we had like two idles that early on. There's a third one. Uh, let's reclaim this now and we will begin adding in. So that should be fine. Let's make sure we bring this down just so that we start eating our energy immediately. Go into two more. And we should go into a construction lab here. I just realized this this guy's not helping out. So let's go drop that down. So we're at the four minute mark here. So this is pretty decent. So let's put this down here as well. Actually, I think that should be enough because we are... We're technically... We're, we're playing aircraft and that's going to use a bit more energy here. I just got to be careful with you. An allied commander self-destructed. Alright, so we're just going to go into a whole bunch of Falcons to start. I think we're going to like 15 or so. <clears throat> and I think I might just keep scaling energy while I'm doing this. Alright, looks like everything's going well. You can see how, how much energy we're stacking up here. I'm going to go into another Nano. Do I really have to put our storage down here? I'm fearful that we might have to put another storage down here. 
I'm just going to put in one more nano. Because what I, I guess I'm going to spend my metal on T2 after this, right? Like that that's going to be the goal. So we're up to five minutes here. Is he com dropping as well? Oh my god, do we have the double com drop? Let's go. Oh, look at the coverage right now. It's pretty decent. Let's go. All right, let's do T2. So hopefully he's blown his comm by now. T2 unit detected. Unload, unload, unload. All right, commander. Let's go. This is our mission. Oh, hey, buddy. I need to get that T2 lab. Oh my God, I didn't get the T2 lab. Where did all my... It's, it's all right, it's okay. We should be fine from that. An allied commander Tell you what, that died. gave me a little bit of the... So we... We didn't do anywhere near as much damage as we, we should have, and we gave over. I didn't realize he wouldn't blow his comp. Normally, uh, people blow their comp in that position. But it looks like he's T2. So my ally, he didn't come in with the attack. I don't know what, what his plan was. He, he I saw him bring the comm, but that's absolutely fine. It was a bit of a fail on my part. I probably should have gone closer in. Next time, I definitely need to go closer in. I'm, I'm going to just like drop, drop down right there next to it. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. We need a Zeus ASAP. Oh, oh, this isn't pretty. Big leak on that front line. Oof. I don't like our chances here. Things did not go well for us. If we can get these D guns off, these could be big. Oh, massive. All right, so I think we can just reclaim now. So we'll just reclaim this guy. They look like they can hit over here, so that should be fine. Definitely didn't do a lot of a lot of damage, and we gave him three or 2.5k metal, basically. Which is really painful. I, I, are you prior? I think they're prioritizing repairing over assisting the um, the constructions, which is kind of wild when you think about it. So how do we get back in the game from here? Because we've been taken out by the enemy player. We could look for another bombing run because we've got big attacks coming in from the south side. So there's a weakness down here. So I think we might look to do something like that. We could go into seaplanes potentially, but. Do we really have a lot of build power? Probably not. I think seaplanes could work here. I think I think we're just going to follow this up with seaplanes. Seaplanes is a lot lower barrier to invest on uh, on everything, right? Like, l let's just do it. I, actually, we don't have a hover, though. If we were to go into seaplanes, we'd need to get a hover out. So that's going to take us some time to get to. Let's make sure we get this up as well. Maybe we just go into T2 aircraft and just go for a big bombing run. But it's such a big investment, though. Let's get that down there. Oh, one of them can help. That's not terrible. All right. 
So l let's just go into T2 air from this position because it's not something that I often do, but it's a great way that you can finish the game through air. So let's look to do this. We just got to be careful not to... We got to allow this guy to get up. So let's put down our... Let's bring these guys back for, for the moment. And help out over here. How much radius does that have? So it gets most things, but we can get rid of these and we'll build our T2 over here at the top. I should have built one construction aircraft before I left. Low power. It, it kind of messes me up. And now we got low power because we brought all of our cons back. Let's put these guys on high priority. Playing air from the Geo. That's the new meta. That's the new meta, baby. Uh, so I think we'll put it round about here. All right. So we'll look to put in here. And let's just put down a whole bunch of these. We're going to reclaim our nanos, so I'm not too fussed about them. So I don't think we need to go into a T2 aircraft, but we definitely want to go into more nanos. So that should probably be enough, something like that. All right, so I'm going to go into high winds initially. It's going to take us some time. Uh, that's probably enough on the... I, I say that's probably enough, but then you get stall outs like this where we've got heaps of energy. So let's see what our air player is doing. So he's still on T1, which is great. So I don't know how much damage has been done to the enemy. Realistically, I, I did not achieve what I wanted to do. If I hit his T2 lab, it would be a totally different ball game right now. Because it looks like he's got some, uh, some pyros coming out. So I'm going to look to push a radar down. So we'll put it down over here. So let's suck this bad boy up. We don't need this anymore. Okay, so I think that's going to be enough nanos for now. I don't think we need to go more than that. You can see how quickly it starts to drain our energy. Alright, so that should give us good coverage here. We've got to keep you guys on the move. One of you can come out over and grab this. Looks like anti-nuke is coming up for us. Wonderful. That's normally my job, uh, but I sometimes forget to do it, I will be honest. Yeah, you can see, like, how much energy we're actually draining out at the moment. Like, can we even spend our metal? Our metal? I think our metal's going up. I mean, we'll, we'll be making bombers. So it's probably not terrible. Uh, so let's start reclaiming. Actually, let's get you to help out here. Like that. Okay, so we are eating into our metal, which is wonderful. It's exactly what we want to be doing. Who's got T2 that I can buy again? Military grade cat, I can hook you up. Uh, 340M. After I finish this one, I'll hand it over to him. That'll do. That, that's fine. Thank you. <laughs> very, very, thank you very much. All right, so we're still sitting on 2K here. So we're up to quite a fair bit of fighters. All right, so I think this is going to be enough because we'll be on 30. So now let's go into blizzards. So how many blizzards do we want? I think probably 10 is fine. 10 is enough to kill an Aphis, right? Now we go in, we kill this guy, we kill his Aphis, and we lose our bombers. So maybe let's go into 20. That way we can follow up with additional hits afterwards because we want to go kill the air guy straight away. So I think we'll go into 20 bombers. Wait, do we just go into a, a lychee? Maybe that's the play. Maybe I just go... I'll go into 10 bombers, one light chi. Oh, this, this is going to be hard, though. I tell you what, this is going to be really tough. Are we still... Yeah, we're still picking up our energy, which is wonderful. 
a little bit more down here. Just a couple more over here. Look how much we're stacking up this metal. Oh my lord, dude. I th I think I've got to drop the lychee and... Uh, actually, let me... Don't do that. Don't do that. I know they're going to help out. No, no, no. Wrong thing, wrong thing. There we go. <clears throat> okay, so the lychee should just power us through here. Okay. Where is... Oh, my dude's air is up here. It's just T1. Front is hanging by a thread, he says. What can we do to help the front? I, I can bring out some T2. Like, I can bring out some snipers, I guess. I want to go into 10. Where's my lychee at? There he is. So once I've got the 10 bombers, that's, that's when I'm going. We need to get this back because we're going to reclaim. Let's go into snipers at the front. Oh, yeah, that's that's definitely time to go. So we want to come up over the top like that. Uh, that is enough, thank you. Dude, he's got nothing in here. What the hell? There's the Aphis there. the nanos the nanos were right there i think a little bit left a little bit left boom baby oh we got it oh it feels so good to get that all right that's enough snipers for now Let's start pushing back on this front. All right, so I'm pretty happy with how that went. Uh, metal, we can definitely look to consume as well. Where are our Lazarus? Here they are. So nice little waves of attack, but nothing too crazy. It looks like a whole bunch of hounds are out here. I should not be reclaiming this right now. But hopefully this is enough just to scare them off. Right, that's all we want. We just want enough... Like, where they're like, oh, well, we can't fight that. You know, the sniper's out. That, that's that's what we want, essentially. So let's push this up a little bit, just so we've got energy. There we go. So they'll hear the sniper sounds. And now they should hopefully back off. They've got snipers themselves. So we're going to go into T2. We're going to go into... How's our eco player? Oh, wonderful. Oh, I love it. It's so nice having a competent eco player. Okay, so we want to go into... Do we want to make a few more? Let's make a few more of these nanos. Actually, I think we're fine. We're, we should be fine off that. All right. So let's get these shots out. Actually, I just realized because we're reclaiming the front, we can totally make more nanos. Yeah, everyone's going snipers. The sniper meta, dude, I'll tell you what, man. 
I've been noticing so many people just play snipers now. It's really strong. All right, Aphis online. We're good. So we can look to add in another row out there. Just so we know where we're sitting. Now, how far does that anti-nuke go? Uh, I'll probably need to add a new anti-nuke as well soon. So do we... I, I mean, there's a lot of units up here and we don't have a lot of units. So I sh Oh my God, they just surrendered. Okay, all right, fair enough. Wonderful, we'll take it. I don't know why or what happened. <laughs> what? How? Was it the... Wait, what? What happened? Is it is it bossed? Did somebody use stop? Yeah, look, you, you can see. None of, no one on their team is typing, so I'm going to assume that, like, everything was above board there. Okay. Uh, so that went well. That, <laughs> that was a bit tough. I tell you what, like, I did not expect that. How did our eco player go? 3.5 mil, so he's doing absolute God's work up there. It looks like every everybody played really well on my team. Uh, let's take a look at the graphs here. Metal produced, energy produced. Yeah, my my uh, my eco was doing a great job. Um, yeah, I'm not I'm not sure exactly what happened there. That was a little bit wild, but uh, in in the end, I'll I'll take that trade, and uh, we'll catch you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching.